Welcome to beautiful Encino, California. Right behind me is Havenhurst Avenue. And if you are a Michael Jackson fan, I don't have to explain to you where we are right now. I'm here once again at the Michael Jackson compound that Joe Jackson bought for the Jackson family in 1971 for $250,000. And guess what? The gate is open. I feel like I just want to walk inside and what's up guys? Hey, it feels like I belong to the family. I've been here to the Thriller Night twice and I walked around and it's unbelievable that they give us the opportunity to walk around at Michael Jackson's place. So today it's a little bit different. Today they're not going to have the King of Pop event. They have the King of Popcorn event, which means they show in the backyard a movie as Rush Hour 2 with Chris Tucker. And who knows, maybe Chris Tucker shows up. He's been here before, so we'll see how it goes. It's unbelievable what kind of history this place has. Michael Jackson's mailbox. How many celebrities push those buttons to get into the compound here? They got cameras everywhere, here, here, here. I was here before. And I had a tripod set up right here in the middle to film myself and security came out and said I cannot be here in front of the door because maybe a car is coming out or not. And today I'm actually walking in again, but this time it's going to be a little bit different hopefully because there's daylight still and we can see what the whole place looks like during the day because the last two times I was here, you could only see it at night and you can't really see anything good because they had all the Halloween decoration in front of everything. I've seen so many videos of Michael being here when he bought his dad like a boat, a motorboat, and all this happened in the back. And you feel like you know this place. <laughs> you know what I don't understand is, it's 2.30 right now, and the event is supposed to start at three o'clock. And look at this, crickets. There's nobody here, only the German in Venice. I just can't get that out of me to be always on time or even before everything starts. That's the German in me, I believe. I cannot get rid of that. And you guys know, one of my hobbies is to match up pictures. Even though I've done it before, I brought those pictures. Like I said, I'm hoping to get some good shots without the Halloween decoration in the background. So wish me luck that I have enough time to match those pictures. It is an outdoor event and a lot of people come here and they think California is warm. I got my down jacket with me just in case. The anticipation is getting crazy. We walking in on Thriller Night. You see on the sides I had a fence here with all pictures of Michael Jackson. But I really like the way it looks here because this is the natural look. Can't believe it. We're doing it again. The GIV is leading the crowd. You got a security booth here to make sure everything is okay. And look who we got here. Betsy. That's what I like about coming to events like this. You see people you know. What's up, Betsy? What's happening, We're here again. I know. I love being here with you. You probably met Betsy before in my videos, so I'm glad we're back here today. They got the red carpet out already. And people are walking in. And like I said, it's not it's not the king of pop, it's the king of popcorn. Wow. Now we finally can see everything in daylight. It looks so much nicer for me. Of course, I start matching up pictures right away. Look how big that tree got. There's Michael sitting on the Mercedes. And look, the tree, uh, maybe not double the size, but big, big, big. There's another big picture. They actually show pictures where he was standing. There's another one with Louis the Lama, where he's in the driveway. And we got free popcorn, as much as you want, and cotton candy. There's a band playing over there. People can take pictures on the red carpet, but I really like that fountain here because that's exactly where Janet and Latoya were sitting. 
Here's another picture where he's standing in front of the tree. Man, this is so crazy to imagine that all the Jacksons were standing here, especially Michael, right here. And look who's coming right here. Liam, he's also ambassador for the Michael Jackson Foundation. Good to see you, my man. Good to How see you, you, man. Good to see you. Man. All righty. So Liam, you've been here before a few story. times. Yeah. But it's always good to come back, right? I this is... It's always great to be here. You can feel the energy as soon as you walk in. Michael's playing. We're wearing bad right now. <laughs> uh, this is the place to be today. And it's the first time the Hill Los Angeles Foundation has done this event. And I am so glad that you're here, bro. Of I'm course. So I here. couldn't miss that one. We've yeah. seen each other on the Thriller night before. I've been to his house. I showed his place. If you want to see that video, check it out. He also has a YouTube channel and he has a video where he's walking around here. He got the exclusive footage, so check him out. Thank you. Peace good, and love. Good to see you. Peace good and love. You, my brother. When you match up the pictures, you see the door in the back. He was sitting right here. This is so much fun matching up those pictures. And when you go up, the main entrance is here. This is a famous picture where he is sitting. Wow, look at this. I had no idea that Don King was hanging out with Michael Jackson here. Another picture with Louis the Llama right here in the driveway. Right here, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Cannot match up enough pictures here. Latoya and Janet Jackson. They got a band playing here in the corner. Plenty of Mexican food. We got beans, we got chips, guacamole, and chicken. I always wanted to see this welcome sign here. I'm not the only vlogger here, so check out her channel. I love the Jackson family. I love the Jackson family, all right. I knew you were coming today <laughs> and it feels like we've been here so many times I it know, feels like we belong here, here you know here that's right yeah so I'm really glad I'm good to see you man you and look I'm getting goosebumps right here that's something you cannot fake you know so enjoy the day here and I like how everybody dress up she got the jacket on and a nice t-shirt king of popcorn nice Michael's footprints are everywhere King of Popcorn. Latoya. Michael always loved to have candies everywhere. And finally I get to see this little store here. He had his little toy store and flower store right next to each other. I'm really glad to see this. DJ is playing Michael Jackson music and right here in the corner is where history was made. This is the recording studio where Michael recorded Bad, Off the Wall and Thriller. And those are actually images from the Thriller night. They had this little studio set up. Unbelievable. I would love to go up here and look at this nice sign here. Those who reach, touch the stars. 
That's where he had all the llamas and all the animal cages. And right here, when you get up the stairs, this is where Michael Jackson's room was. See, who is the young man next to you here? All right. And look, Betsy made all those cookies for us. No, I'm just joking. More candy everywhere. Too bad I can't have the candy. They have plenty of merch. They got jackets signed by BG and Prince. There's Janet Jackson found a popcorn machine, which was at the Neverland Ranch. You can't come to Michael Jackson's place and have popcorn without Tabasco. You're kidding. He, he always used to put have, his... He always have to have Tabasco sauce on his popcorn. I have to try that. I didn't know. Yes. So here you go. Get you some popcorn and make sure you try it with Tabasco. All right. Thank you. I didn't know. Now you know. That's right. Now I know. And you everybody know. else knows too. Absolutely. You got me some candies from Japan. I'm watching my videos. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, thank you. This rhythm nation with a cool pose. What's up, Darren? What's Good up? To see you, bro. No thriller night this year, but this is an awesome event right here. Can you tell us what it is? First ever King of Popcorn event. We're screaming Rush Hour 2, one of my dad's favorite movies with our good friend Chris Tucker. It's going to be a real special night. That's absolutely awesome. It's so much different. I always wish to come here during the day to see it daylight. I want to say thank you for inviting us over here. This is for every Michael Jackson fan the biggest thing to do. And then people fly from Germany, Japan, they come from all over. And all the, uh, the proceeds to this, where is it going to? Straight into our programs. We had a great year with three full programs over at Laredo Street Elementary. And we're looking to build some more programs in 2024. So all of the donations go 100% to the program. It's here Los Angeles. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you, bro. All right. Prince talking to all the fans. Lots of Disney's inspired artwork everywhere. I like those pictures here. Those are actually pictures before they renovated the house. And this is the setup. Lots of bean bags. Really comfortable with like blankets and pillows. Mr. Joe Jackson right here at the poolside. I want to do a shout out to Esther from Switzerland and her Michael Jackson fan group. You see the staircase right here? It used to be right here in the corner and they were all standing on the spiral staircase. And there's the den. Michael is actually right here, I think. That's where he was sitting. Latoya was the one that called that. Is it a German cuckoo's clock? I don't know, it looks like it, but she's the one that bought it with Michael and she said in an interview, that's a really, really old clock. Latoya checking out the renovation. Creating or musically or this was Mrs. Jackson's room. 
I cannot say that often enough. I think it's absolutely incredible that they allow the fans to walk around here on property and see where the Jacksons live. The Jacksons, their kids, Prince lived here, Paris, they all lived here. I think I see this property with a totally different eye than other people because I've seen all those pictures, videos, and I love to match it up. Michael was standing right here. Wow. I was never able to match up this picture where you're standing at the gazebo with bubbles. walk through the little garden they have in the back here. Got different koi fish in here. These little statues. I mean, if you're a Michael Jackson fan, this will not get better than this. Unless you see them in concert. There's a picture of Latoya. And Janet. said how often you have the chance to walk around here this is the staircase where it goes upstairs from the front Katherine Jackson and her husband Joe Jackson were actually sitting inside the place right here on a motorcycle The trophy room. You probably think they bought this sign, King of Popcorn. No, Prince's girlfriend actually made this by hand. Absolutely incredible. I was really surprised when I looked at it closer. Nice job. So I'm actually here with John Mudo. He's the president of the Here Los Angeles organization and I just want to say thank you so much to open the doors here to make this possible for all the fans all over the world man this is absolutely incredible like I said I've been here a few times I met you before but today is the best time I think thank you so much no thank you and I appreciate all your support and thank you for everyone else's support all of our donations go straight back to our programs and initiatives and signature events so we appreciate everyone's support and thank you Michael appreciate it and uh, it was at heal los angeles dot what is it called is heal it heal la fdn dot com all right thank you no problem thank you had to rock the red carpet man i think i have the same jacket you have right there that's my jacket i told you the german knows it's cold here getting cold right and she only got like a little dress on right there but it's all good <laughs> can i wear it can i give it a thing sure oh thank you there's jermaine I knew I'm gonna meet her here. What do you think? Is it better thriller night or is it better when you see it during the day? I love seeing it during the day. Like this actually reminds me of like the Jackson's movie, you know, American Dream. Like seeing it in the daytime, I just feel 
feel like so connected to the Jacksons. It's really awesome. I feel the same way. I like for the night, but I love walking around you because we've seen it on YouTube. We've seen our different places. I love it. Yes. Don't forget to subscribe to her. I put her link right here. She has lots of Michael Jackson content. Yes, thank you. Look at what she's wearing right here. She got a jacket. She bought it right here. And who signed it? Prince and BG. Check it out. Prince and BG signed it in the bag. They have lots of merch over there. We check it out in a minute. Yeah. Thank you. Most of the Michael Jackson fans, they knew about this event. Some they didn't. If you don't know, it's actually a donation you uh, post to the Heal Los Angeles Foundation and then you can uh, attend this event. The donation was $777. I know what you say and you say, this is crazy expensive. It is really expensive. But for me, I'm seeing it as a positive thing. You know, the money I'm spending, I donate, goes to a good cause to people in need or kids in need. And um, I can actually come here and film all this for the people all over the world, the biggest Michael Jackson fans, they never have a chance to come here. So it's a win-win situation. And believe me, I love being here. I can just walk around here all day and film. So I'm glad I did it. And if you think about how Michael came up with 777, that was his favorite number. And that's why they actually charged $777. You can see on Michael Jackson's um, tour jacket, he has the 777 on his arm. I might can put the picture in here. And maybe it's because he's the seventh kid of uh, nine childs. Maybe it's because his first name, his last name has seven letters, Michael Jackson, seven, seven. But uh, we know that seven was Michael Jackson's favorite number. So having that said, now you know and hopefully they're going to do the same event next year and you'll be able to do the same thing you have to do it once in a lifetime i know it's a lot of money but what can i say there's something you will never forget for the rest of your life another really good thing is the people that come to an event like this they come to thriller night so there's kind of a group of people you always see and you become friends you share your interests and just have a good time I mean, this is where everybody was. Janet, Rivi, Latoya, Tito, Randy, Jermaine, Marlon, Jackie, and of course, Michael. Wow, check out his jacket here. Let's not check out his jacket. He's let's check out his jacket. Michael had those stairs put in so he can walk right from his bedroom all the way to his studio. Every day he was walking up those stairs here. Wow. And going up this doorway, goes straight up to the memory room where Michael Jackson put all the pictures of his family on the wall. I've never been in there, hopefully one day. Well, and look who I'm running into, Michael Bush. The greatest designer of clothing. He actually designed Michael Jackson's outfit many times. I actually went to your star when you got it in Palm Springs. Nice. And, uh, which is November the 9th, which is National Michael Bush Day every year in Palm Springs. I didn't know that. And you told and me something I did not know. Sorry that I okay, no, interrupted no. you. So. Sorry, that's right. No, and then when we were doing the star, we wanted to go watch them install it. Okay. For the documentary like Michael, we wanted to record the history of it happening. So underneath that glove, I mean, underneath that star, a 500 pound piece of granite. There's a Ziploc bag with some photos of me with Michael. Okay. And one of his rhinestone gloves. I didn't know that. So you always learn something so, new. That's what I'm telling you. When you come to events like this, you meet the most yeah. incredible people. And of course you have the opportunity to take pictures with Prince on the red carpet. So now the nightfall came and it still looks really nice at night. I've been filming from the minute I got here and I still feel like I didn't film enough. Uh, hopefully I got enough footage for you guys. Statues everywhere you go. Well, Let's go check out the movie. 
amazing work. Pretty comfy. And then we also have churros and uh, mini pancakes on the side, if you guys don't know about that. It's really good to see so many of familiar faces coming back. I'm really happy to see our staff and teachers and families from Laredo Street Elementary. Um, if you ever question why we do what we do, it's because of you beautiful people. Uh, you give us so much love and inspiration, and it's truly a pleasure and an honor to know you guys, to build these relationships with you guys. The kids have just been fantastic. We've had three great programs this year. We're looking to continue it, and it's really thanks to all of you guys who, like John said, you continue to donate and to support because you trust in us and you know that it's going to the right place. And moving forward into 2024, John and I are even more committed to be doing more great work with Laredo Street Elementary. We really want to make a difference in these kids' lives. And it's an honor and a privilege to be able to share in the love for family, for my father, for kids. And that's why we're all here. So for all of you Laredo Street kids, if you don't know, all of us here today, we love you very much and happy to have you. So without further ado, uh, I think we're going to get this movie started. It stars, obviously, Jackie Chan and a good dear friend of ours, Chris Tucker. He's always been fantastic. And this was one of my dad's favorite movies growing up. So it's a real treat to be able to sit here, watch the film with you guys. We used to actually sleep out here on this grass and have our own little movie night. So welcome to our family's home. Welcome to being a part of our family. And I just I have a lot of love for all of you here tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's Chris Tucker, all right. Look how comfortable they snuck up there. No, we need that some I want to see some women, man. There he is. He's actually a really good dancer. He doesn't like it. Come on. Come on. Everybody watching the movie outside? Post. I like all the real wood here. It looks really nice. You see the fountain still has the blood on from Thriller Night. I can't believe it's been a year already. Time flies. Michael and Michael. To the fans and to everybody who's here tonight, um, Please give us your feedback. Uh, I, John's told me that there will be a survey. I'm going to turn it over to him so we'll be able to do that. But thank you so much for coming out on a Friday night. We do appreciate your time. We appreciate you being here with us. And just sharing in the love that is my father, that is his legacy, and the foundation that is Heal Los Angeles. So thank you guys so much. And we look forward to seeing you at the next one. It was a successful evening. Everybody's leaving. And look what you get when you walk out. You get like a little goodie bag. Another successful evening. We're walking out the door. Who knows when we come in here the next time. But I also wanted to show, look, this is the gate. For years I was standing in front of, I could never get in. And I'm in now, look, I'm here. I'm standing right here. Now I'm not, <laughs> now I'm back in. And look, I was not the only one standing in front of... How old were you in that picture? What do you mean, 13? This was 13. September 2009, my first time in LA. And I stopped by here, obviously. Yeah. And here we are. And now we've been here so many times, man. I got to go in one more time. Hold on. In. Out. Well, my friends, that was it. Live here from the Havenhurst estate where Michael Jackson with his whole family lived. I must say, this was absolutely incredible. I always say that, but uh, I never, never, ever thought when I was sitting in front of that TV in Germany and Thriller came out, I'm sitting there with my friends and I had no idea that I'd one day be at the house where he lived and he actually wrote Thriller and 
bad and off the wall so i just love it to be here and i hope you guys had a good time too if that fountain could speak anyway if you happen to like this video please give it a thumbs up push the notification bell and subscribe to the german in venice <clears throat> I actually ate something just now, a little fried chicken. It was really good, but I'm not supposed to eat that stuff. But today was a special day. Anyway, see you guys later.